this video I'm going to show you the installation on this kicker tailgate stereo amplifier unit that you can purchase online I purchased it from eBay I'm not sure I would recommend that again because I received it I installed it it didn't work had to contact kicker they had me ship them out the amplifier they shipped me a new amplifier so I'm gonna pull all that stuff out of there, show how everything goes in, put it all back together and hope it works. So normal installation, you'll take out these bolts and you'll pull that rubber piece off. And you'll take these out here, here and here, lift this out of the way, and you can get in there to install the wires and the mounting plate. And then the wires just run across here like this, down here. They come right through there, drop down, and then they plug into where your oh, your uh, trailer wiring and stuff like that just it pops in there and then clicks on the other side of it. Real simple installation. Don't need any extra tools or anything like that. So that part is simple. So here's the first part of the video, and this is a 2023 uh, Denali HD 3500. I'm pretty sure all the way from 2019 through 2023, it's the same unit as long as you have this tailgate. You have to have this type of tailgate, and then that system will work in there. So, But I still can't tell you how good it works because I haven't got to use it yet. So This has been an ongoing few-month operation here. So, But this is the only add-on that this truck did not have, so that's why I went and ordered it just you know if you're boondocking want some tunes outside i think that's a pretty cool way to do it so but let's get back to working on it and see what we got all right let's show you the best i can show you but you can see right down in there this bolt right here and that bolt right up in there there's one on each side that's the little piece that you have to put in there to hold the amplifier there's another bolt right there, and there's one right up in there. It's pretty, pretty simple. Just slide it right in there. You have to put that in first before you put in the amplifier. All right, so you need to insert the amplifier from this direction here. Then you can go over and screw this wire in. Don't put this one on until you put the two screws in because one of the screws is right underneath it there. You can see my fingers, there's two of them. And then there's two on this side. And you don't put that wire in until you put it out there. There you can see the screws. Hopefully you can see the screws. And then bolt all four of those screws down. Then plug this wire in. And it comes with a zip tie to zip tie that right to there. So you can do that. And make sure you put this plate in before you try putting the whole thing in. The plate goes in first, then the amplifier. Then you can plug this wire in. This is your safety switch, you plug that wire in. What this does is so when you drop the tailgate, it sends power to it. When it's in this position, it's not sending power to it. And you just hook your speakers up. Pretty simple there, comes with this uh, weather stripping you gotta put around there so it seals it better. This is the accessory wire, it goes right into there. So you can plug your phone in, charge it at the same time as it's playing. And we just got to put it back together here. See if she works. Just remember to plug all your wires in. Other than that, it's not too complicated. And just remember to insert this in here first because these go underneath this. This drops on top of it. Let's give you a look at what it looks like before I bolt it back in there. Okay, as you can see, the bolts are all back in. You now it comes with this. You need to drill it and put two screws in it, but for some reason my kit was missing the screws, so I'll pick some self-tappers up and put in there later on. But you got one there, there. But it all went in really nice, so. Well, there's the finished product. It actually sounds awesome. Um, 
if, I don't think YouTube will let me play the music because I don't have copyrights, but uh, if you email us at theriverstonelife at gmail.com, I can send you a video of what it sounds like. And if you like these type of videos, hit the thumbs up button. And if you'd like to see more of them, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching, everybody. Mm -hmm.